With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Let's discuss the given problem. If we are given a water and a canal and then in that canal the dimensions are given to us 30 dm wide and 12 dm deep and water is flowing in with a velocity of 20 kilometers per hour then we are asked that how much area will it irrigate in 30 minutes if 9 centimeter of standing water is desired right so first of all a canal is there and in that canal the dimensions of the canal that is the width of the canal and the depth of the canal is given to us right now we are asked to find the area that will be irrigated if 9 centimeter standing water is desired okay so first of all we need to learn one thing that is the units are more important to us right another thing is that the dimensions of water canal that is this canal are given to us in decimeters right and we know that one meter is basically equivalent to one meter is equivalent to 10 dm right so we are going to use this concept okay so first of all first of all when we say that the y width of the canal is 30 dm then we can say that the width of the canal becomes equivalent to 30 dm and that is equivalent to 3 meters right another important thing which we can comment upon is depth that is equivalent to 12 dm and that becomes equivalent to 1.2 meter right now these are the two basic dimensions of our canal right now if the flowing velocity of water is 20 kilometers per hour right so let us convert this also v is equivalent to 20 kilometers per hour so let us convert this to meter per second so to convert this into meter per second we need to multiply this with kilo with thousand because conversion of kilometers to meters and divide it by 3600 right so this becomes equivalent to this gets also divided right so this becomes 5 and this becomes 9 okay so this is equivalent to 50 upon 9 meter per second now this becomes the velocity through which the pipe water is flowing right now how much area is irrigated in 30 minutes so let us convert this time period also in 30 minutes how many seconds would be there so this would be equivalent to 30 multiplied by 60 and that is equivalent to 1800 seconds so number of seconds would be 1800 right now if 9 centimeter standing water is desired see we know that if water is continuously flowing then water will be accumulated which is going to be used for irrigation right now if it is said that 9 centimeter standing water is desired right that is if uh, water is currently flowing in a canal like this is our canal okay now water is flowing and it is required that 9 centimeter height of the canal is there okay and we know that that currently water is flowing and we do not know the area so basically it is asked that what amount of area will be irrigated so for that we need to calculate the amount of water that is that is there flowing in this period of time right in this time period it is flowing okay so first of all we need to count we need to figure out the volume of water that will be there under irrigation if this time is there and speed is there and this is so volume that is volume would be given by the product of width into depth into into velocity into time why because we know that this is the length of water that will be accumulated in particular time period and this should be the volume right so this becomes the volume of water so finally this is 3 into 1.2 into 50 upon 9 into 1800 right so this becomes 200 and finally this becomes 3 into 1.2 into 10,000 right so this value is obtained as 36123 36,000 and this is meter cube so this becomes the volume of water now 
this is equivalent to 9 centimeter height multiplied by the area under irrigation which we need to calculate right so from here we can calculate the value of a now before that we need to convert this centimeter into meters so that would be equivalent to 0 0.09 meters multiplied by a and this becomes 3600 meter cube right so we can write this as a is equivalent to 36 this is not 3600 this is 36000 multiplied by 100 divided by 9 so this becomes 4000 right and the area so becomes 4 into 10 raised to the power 5 meter square so this becomes the area that gets irrigated if 9 centimeter of water is sanding water and these are the dimensions of canal and the time period is this much and with the velocity of flow as this much for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today